Just, yeah, literally landed. Uh, I was working all night on um, John Wick with uh, Keanu Reeves and had an amazing night of shooting. I mean, it was just freaking awesome. Had, I was there for like a month and a half. Got to come up with a lot of the driving gags and train Keanu and he did so insanely well. I think he did more driving in this movie than I think any actor's ever done in a movie. And technical, like not easy driving. So that was super fun and um, literally went from set to the airplane, got off the airplane, got in the race car. Um, Yokohama was nice enough to grab my gear and stuff from my house and put it in their truck to come out here. So it's all here, getting dressed, hitting the track. I've got more left side weight giving me a grip on the start. We're going to be golden. I mean, to me, it's about where the whole thing Yeah, it was a, oh my God, I just cut myself for the first time and it had to be on camera. I've never talked while shaving before, I guess. That's dangerous. So anyway, here we are, Nitro Relic Rust. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta get cleaned up for uh, Travis. He wants everybody's pit to look nice. He wants everybody to shave. Notice Cabot hasn't done that. Yeah. Oh, hell no. <laughs> hell no. <laughs> this took me way too long to grow. What I like is using an oily shop rag. That's the key. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Cabot, you ready to do this? Good as new. The more they tell you, yeah. and the more information you're armed with, in my opinion, driving, it's better because then sometimes, if there's a dude in front of you, and you're in the dust, and you slow down, if you accelerate, if you push the button and accelerate up to it, then it doesn't get as quite a high, as high a value yeah. as if you're going over the speed and then push it and bring it back. Right. How's your lip? Still cut. I mean, talking and shaving. Is that your worst worries? No. <laughs> I got some bigger worries right now. They are suited, booted, and ready to sit in! Here we are, Nitro Rallycross Supercars. Again, Pastrana, Hanson, Arpin, Erickson, Speed, Backward, Madonna, and Faust. just 
puked its whole suspension out <laughs> on live <laughs> television. It was great. Yeah. yeah, I did not expect that. All of a sudden, I just see like did shrapnel. Did you just see shocks and yeah. springs? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I did. I saw a spring and like a piece of the shock just fly in front of me. I was like, oh, this is great. Yeah, I'm just going to keep going. Yeah. That's, yeah, that was awesome. It sums up the day. Oh, well, well, yeah, super dusty. I mean, it's crazy dusty. And sadly, we knew that the first first time we got here. They worked so hard to try to make it a non-issue, but were kind of unsuccessful. And I, they worked really, really hard, and they did make it better. But in the final, it, if you were not in the front, you were completely lost. Um, so I, I just tried to stay clean, I just, as it were. I just tried to, like stay clear of everything. I followed back route around a little bit um, and came into a completely blind jump and Travis couldn't see me and just followed through right through me and I ended up by losing the whole left rear of the car suspension and everything. So I uh, did another lap very, very slowly and then pulled off. Don't know what place that puts us in. Out of the 14 cars, I think are seventh or eighth. But um, yeah, this is a very dusty track. Hopefully the next one won't quite be such a, a hard, you know, it's difficult with track maintenance, but hopefully the next one will be a little better.